Look at the front where it says Ames real big. Okay guys, so we are in the middle of nowhere, Ohio at this motel, and um, I'm joined with Richard Wolf, Kayla, as she runs up into the camera here, <laughs> with her cute Hi, little Holly. respirator. Hi. <laughs> I'm also joined with Kara, there's the wild Richard behind me, <laughs> Terry and Nikki Altman. We are all exploring for the first time today. We're having a blast out here. I cannot believe we haven't been caught at this hotel. You're going to... Because we already filmed this place, and we're going to show you the adventures that we had here. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. All right, guys, here it is, this quaint little motel. we go check out. This place looks amazing. This place is rough. Yeah. This has definitely seen better days. Oh look! It's a drive-through. I see that. Yeah. I ain't gonna try to get to that door. Yeah. As long as they don't care. That's boarded up there. That door's boarded up. <laughs> this was a hotel, all right. Little motel, the windows are open. Wide open basement. See, this is one of those things. Do we try to go in there or not? Yeah, we already saw one snake. There are the rooms here. A couple little rooms, not many, rather small. There's a golf ball. It never fails. Everywhere we go, there's always a golf ball. Every place we go to, Kara. <laughs> This is not the first time. Oh, wow, it goes way back here. Why is that? The one room's open. Two rooms, three rooms, four, five. All these rooms are open. Let's go in and check out a couple of these little hotel rooms. What? What? What's wrong? You're smiling, so it can't be bad. <laughs> what are you smiling about? Here. Oh, it opens. Nice. Well, all the ones back there are all open, too. Oh, my God. Smells oh. like mold. <laughs> I remember my face mask. Mine's in the car. It's really not that bad, honestly. That a, oh, it's I dusty. Already got, I already got sick from mold one time. I'm probably going to get it right here. No. We're only in here for literally like a minute. There's still phone books in here. There's still phone books in here. Good. Kayla got a respirator. Wow, that smells musty. There's a Bible. Do you like it? Yeah. <laughs> you look like that one member of the Gazette. Yes, that. thank you. I wanted you to say that. With the uh, mask on. Thank you. The old Kenmore microwave. How do you break the front of the microwave? How desperate are you to break things? To break the front door of the microwave for real. There's another bathroom in here. What is this? Like a conjoining room, I guess. Yeah, yeah it is. Because here's the other bathroom here. No window in this bathroom at all, which is creepy. Yeah, that is really creepy. It's like the size of our bathroom. Maybe yeah. ours is a little bit bigger. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm tired. I might go lay down. July 2009. <laughs> 
<laughs> you want to lay down on that bed? No. <laughs> That's all you it's there, Kayla. Over here. Get comfy in the chair. It <laughs> <laughs> conjoins into three rooms. Literally, we just went into all three rooms. Oh man, what happened back here? Oh, look at the ceiling. Look at the ceiling above you. you it's non-existent. I would put that on my head if that thing wasn't so dirty. <laughs> it's rough. We got a nice, a nice collection of lampshades up. These ones are hurting, but those ones aren't too bad. I know. This is wild. But we just look, literally walked a in. A non-broken mirror. That's why I'm not disclosing where we're at. <laughs> I'm sure the neighbors here don't want that kind of traffic around either, you know, so. Wait till you see all the rooms back there. Back there, all the rooms are open. Yeah. Every one of them. So, guys, yeah, we're here in the middle of nowhere at Ohio at this abandoned motel. I couldn't tell you when this closed, but obviously it's been many years based on the condition that it's in. And with me, I have Richard Kara, uh, Richard and Kara. Richard Kara. Richard and Kara, yeah. <laughs> Terry and Nikki, and Kayla, wherever she wandered off. Back outside. She's back outside. There you are, and Kayla. And we're here just to explore and take some photos and leave. Leave this place the way we found it. I'm gonna go back here. See, I'm not disclosing the location on this place. I know where we're at. I know what town this is in, but I'm not disclosing the location because I don't want the wrong type of people to come here. We come here with the utmost respect, and we just come here to take some photos and video and leave as we like to film and explore and document these places before history is erased. You know, Mother Nature will come in here and just reclaim it like it's doing, so this room is... Seen better days. Look at the old TV. <laughs> Holy crap, is that old? That's older than me. <laughs> and it's upside down, too. Looks like. Maybe. I don't even know. But that TV is ancient. Wow. <laughs> but yeah, this. Uh, Some people always sleep in here. Yeah, I could tell. But. Yeah, Looks this, like always a 60s era TV. Uh, yeah, it's old. Because of these uh, push buttons. Mm -hmm. It's very old. Could be the 80s. Maybe. Oh, cough. There's this bathroom. I'm not going in there. There's spider webs all in there. The tub, it's all grody in there. Go into this room over here. Literally every single room is open. There's an abandoned building back there. I don't even know if I can get back to it because of the weeds and overgrowth. Here's what looks like another conjoining room. This room's in bad shape. I mean, they all are at this point. They've been abandoned for so long. That or it was a two or it was a two bedroom room. Yeah, that went outside. That door's boarded. Yeah, it's like a conjoining room, basically. Yeah, I found some olives. Ew. <laughs> they look absolutely gross. <laughs> Even the lid is rusty. <laughs> yeah, and, and guys, uh, just a little disclosure. If you do come here... Do so at your own risk. I don't condone it. I don't advise you come here. We are taking a huge chance right now because there is literally a neighbor that lives right next door to this place. And every window in their house can see this place. And if they saw us and just don't care, that's one thing. Or if they saw us and, like, they're angry or something, I'm surprised they haven't said anything or they just haven't seen us yet. But we are here only to document this place and leave. But yeah, like I said, they don't want, I don't want to attract the wrong attention here because we're not here to vandalize or cause any damage or trouble. We're only here for maybe, what, 20 minutes or so, and then we'll be out of here. There's a picnic bench here. It looks like this was a pretty cool place, like a nice little cozy place. My little Gazette fan there. <laughs> Yeah, I like the recliner. Yeah, you need it. Uh, I'm all right. It's looking a little rough. 
There's like crickets on it too. That room is, that's all right. I'm not gonna try and climb my fat ass over the chair. <laughs> okay, thanks Kara. Kara to the rescue. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why I like exploring with Kara and Richard. It's fun. <laughs> and Kara has like that, I don't care attitude. I'm just doing it. <laughs> I wish I had that attitude. <laughs> Man, it's musty in here, though. See, a lot of these rooms are just, like, hanging wide open, though, too. The doors are just wide open. We're not even touching anything to go in. We're just literally walking in and heading out of each room. Whew. Man, this place has seen better days. I'd love to go back to that building, but I don't know that yeah. I can with all those weeds. If I had pants on, maybe. Yeah, I've got, like, leggings on. Yeah, well. This is a good work. That's all good. These rooms you can get, too. Man, is that a creepy sight. Just, just how it looks all around here. Oh yeah. But, I will tell you this Richard, this is nowhere near as bad as that day's in, in PA that I did. You guys go there. When you guys go there, I, I definitely recommend you don't go alone and you go during the daytime if you go. Yeah. It's dangerous there. Not only in terms of somebody could be in there, but the place is collapsing like every second. Falling in on itself. Yeah. Now let's try and go in one of these rooms. These weeds are so tall. There's no carpet in this one. It's gone. The ceiling was cut out. Yeah, it looks like the wires were cut. That's weird. This room is tiny. Like, these are some tiny hotel rooms. The toilet's gone. There's just a plug there. That's weird. This is wild. You, you're cute. Oh, thank you. You're cute. <laughs> I'm not. You are. No, I'm rough. I'm about as cute as dog crap. <laughs> what? Oh, geez. Paint galore in here. This is just paint buckets and filth and a shabby ass bathroom. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, this is a cool little hotel. Like these rooms are like uber small though. Like if you have a bed in here, there's really no room for anything else. But if you're just here overnight, if you're traveling, that's not bad. If you're just here just to sleep in here for the night and then hit the road the next day, then that's not bad. This isn't, like, necessarily the type of hotel you stay a whole week at. What's up? Uh, if you haven't seen number three, you Ouch. should see that one. That was the penthouse. I think you rent that one by the hour. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's go in there. I can feel the disease already. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> they call it liquid degrees or deglosser. Oh, my God. Look at the spider in the nest. Yeah. Look at that. Right there. <laughs> then look into the room and up. Mirror, mirror on the ceiling. <laughs> what? Well, isn't this different? Hi, everybody. Hey. Hey, you know, honestly, this isn't a bad view. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the weeds are pretty bad. This one's cozy. This one's a little bit larger. Little kid stickers. Yep. <laughs> McDonald's cup. Somebody might have been living in this one for a little while. Yeah. When I think of this, I'm going to get like weird with this. I think somebody was babysitting someone else's kids and they were acting up. And so they said, you know what? I'm going to lock you in here. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, you know, it's funny. My my friend uh, Jay over at JP Videos, he filmed an abandoned hotel in Breezewood. Yeah, my friend... Uh, Jason with JP videos he filmed a hotel in Breezewood and it was similar to this and a couple of the rooms at the very end were just full of toys and kid stuff and like stickers like that I, I personally believe somebody was living in there and even he said it too yeah. Yeah. so it was a little wild so I wouldn't believe there's a flashlight coming out of the hole in the wall there who is that I it's Richard. <laughs> there was a flashlight coming through the hole <laughs> is that your rich <laughs> Terry Ranch. <laughs> Wait, where are they? Let's see. Look how small this bathroom is. This bathroom's amazing. Like, after you're done taking a dump, you don't even have to get off the toilet to wash your hands. I mean, you could just sit there, wash your hands, and then, like, hop in the shower or something if you want. 
Yeah, and you can actually TP. You can wash your you can wash your hair you while you're sitting on the pot. You can't wash your hands because somebody uh, decided not to sink down. <laughs> uh, imagine raging so hard you decide to take it out. Oh look, there's a teddy bear in here. It's a <laughs> Teddy bear. Air apostle. Air apostle. Ah, oh, somebody was getting their Budweiser on. <laughs> Butt wiper. <laughs> <laughs> a child at heart why don't you get up there too okay. all right this is cool <laughs> don't die <laughs> why not that was so much fun and i did it in a safe map before you even look in there I see the cracked bowling ball. Holy cow. They cracked that thing all the way down to the core. Big one. That's an ebonite ball, too. That's a good ball. I have an ebonite ball. Oh. Ooh. Oh. The neon. There's two of them. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that one just broke. <laughs> That's okay. They're yingling. I, I'm just curious as to whether or not they even work anymore. That is cool. Too bad I'm here with just a take pictures only, leave nothing but footprints type of attitude. Take nothing, leave nothing. God. God dang. I have a Coors Light one somebody was throwing out. They said they didn't know if it worked. I grabbed it off them, plugged it in, it worked. I was like, wow, cool, I got a free neon light. <laughs> Rocky Mountain ice water, but wow, that is cool. Man. Like I, I said, you don't want to be back. I want, I want one of those, but man, I won't, uh, I just won't do it. Yeah, because you'll see me walking out of here with a big Bud Light sign right past the neighbor's house down the street to the car. They're like, where'd you get that from? They're like, somebody gave it to me driving by. <laughs> yeah, guys, this place is... Pretty, pretty intense. Pretty intense. Pretty cool. And furthermore, I really can't believe that nobody said anything. I know. There he is in the wild. The wild Richard Wolf. <laughs> whose urban legend is that he only comes out at night. So here's a rare sighting at dusk. Oh, he awakes. He awakes. We gotta go. He's hiding again. Did he see us? I think he did. I don't know. He's lurking. I feel for my life. I feel like I must go. Let's see if we can sneak up. We're gonna try. Uh-oh. There he is. He's, he's at wild. Where does he go? He's trapped. He doesn't know where to go. <laughs> oh my God. He just ducks behind a tree. <laughs> I can't even do it. Where did the wild Richard Wolf go? He runs off into the wild, into the night, ready to slay another abandoned place. Where the hell did he go? <laughs> Such a dork. <laughs> He's in there somewhere. He's back there picking berries. See, what's it? Hey, you pooping? <laughs> he just ducked up on a tree. Hey, no trespassing. <laughs> yeah, use those three point uh the three pointed leaves. <laughs> what is that? Five your fines, three stay free. Yeah, use the three pointed ones. <laughs> that butt is gonna be burning. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed this look at this abandoned motel in Nowheresville, Ohio. I'm going to leave the name of this place out of it because we don't want to attract the wrong people here, kind of like us, how we're all a bunch of goofballs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I am here with Kayla, Kara, <laughs> Richard Wolf is somewhere. He's right there. <laughs> Terry and Nikki Altman. And uh, together we're all here to explore and film this place. I don't know what's, who's doing what. But make sure you go and subscribe to everybody's channels. We all had a great time exploring this place. Boy, do I feel creeped out. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, check out everybody's channels. Links to their channels are in the video description below. God, that was creepy. That was right in my ear. She's like blowing right into my ear. <laughs> Is that creepy? <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, I'm going to take off and run away from these people. <laughs> Yeah, make sure you check everybody's channels out. Subscribe to everybody here. And uh, just stay tuned for what we have coming up next. You never know. All right, guys. Have a good one. Take care. Stay I awesome. I love you. Bye. I love that you, too. Was, I was saying I love you, the fans. Not okay. You. I love you. Well, I love you, too. <laughs> Bye.